Hey, and welcome back to Dan the Flavor Guy. Today, we're going to be whipping up some chunky guacamole. It's the month of May, so to stick with the Cinco de Mayo theme, we are going to whip up some chunky guacamole. As you can see, I've already started chopping up some onions. I had a half of a large onion, which equals about one cup total. While I'm chopping up these onions, I'm keeping the pieces a little big, because like I said, we're going with a chunky guacamole style. Next up, we're gonna take three large avocados, or maybe four, depending on how much avocado you like. We're gonna cut these avocados in half, and then we're going to take out the seed. Once the seeds are removed, I'm going to go ahead and cut the avocados into quarters. And then I'm gonna lightly slice each quarter into little chunks. After I get the little chunks sliced, I'm gonna go ahead and take a spoon and I'm just gonna scoop the rest of the avocado off of the skin. After all the little avocado pieces are placed into the bowl, this is where we start smashing. Here is where you will determine how chunky you want your guacamole. The more you smash it up, the creamier it gets. So I'm not gonna take a whole lot of time smashing this up because I wanna keep it chunkier. To keep this video quick, I went ahead and already chopped up a quarter cup of tomato. Here, I'm gonna go ahead and add that. And on the cutting board, we have roughly two tablespoons of cilantro that we need to chop up. So we're gonna go ahead and do that right now. I'm chopping the stem off because I really don't wanna use it. And then here we are just mincing the rest of it up. Now that it's all minced, we're gonna go ahead and add it. And then the last step is going to be adding a little bit of salt and pepper. I roughly have one tablespoon of salt, one tablespoon of pepper right here. I'm gonna dump it in. Now the only thing left is to get it stirred up. Once I'm done stirring it, I'm gonna stick it in the fridge for about a half an hour and then it's ready to serve and enjoy. Hey, while we're here, I wanna go ahead and ask you, could you hit that subscribe button if you already haven't? Go ahead and hit that like button too. I really appreciate you spending some of your busy day with me. I hope you enjoy, have a great day, and I'll see you next time.